We've now learned the real reason behind Justin Bieber and Hailey Baldwin's surprise engagement. And Travis Scott is ready to put a ring on Kylie Jenner thanks to her new status. And Danielle Bergoli almost attacked on stage. We're talking about all these things right now on Holly Scoop's Daily Rewind. Happy Friday the 13th. Guys, welcome to Holly's Games Daily Rewind. I'm Madison Hill. And I'm Devin Howard. Um, there's nothing really spooky about, I would say, our rewind today, other Not than quite. some serious drama. Yes. So you guys, Justin and Haley are making headlines um, for their recent date in Brooklyn. They were out yesterday, um, and everyone on the street was basically just like in awe of them. Haley was showing off her abs and of course her massive engagement ring, mm -hmm. which thanks to TMZ, we now know is anywhere between six and 10 carats and cost around, you know, just a casual half a million dollars. Yeah, that's nothing. Like, literal dream ring, dream goals. Yes. Uh, dream goals. It's not even the same thing. Ring <laughs> goals. So, although they were all smiles then, I don't think they will be today because the real reason behind their quickie engagement has been revealed. And we can basically thank Selena Gomez and her new kind of hookup relationship. They're not serious um, with the guy Caleb Stevens, who we talked mm -hmm. about earlier this week. Right. Um, he is the brother of her friend Raquel Stevens. So, interesting. I, um, a source revealed to Radar Online that the two have been hooking up for about a month now. So, like I said, nothing serious. They're just having a little fun. And when Justin found out about it last month, Timeline-wise, this was right around when he started seeing Haley again. Yeah. So it's very interesting how this all works out, right? Um, he confronted Selena about her new man. Um, she brushed it off in an, <coughs> excuse me, in an attempt to not make him mad. But then, of course, because Hollywood's a small town, Justin later found out the truth. And when he did, the source told Radar Online that Justin, quote, freaked out and went absolutely ballistic. Does he have a right to do this? Uh, no, I don't yeah. think so. They're totally broken up. He's with somebody else, or at least he was exploring options. With the He's been exploring options since like the week after they broke up right. with Baskin Champion and mm -hmm. everybody else in between. So he has no right to get mad. And also, Holly Scoopers, if you're watching this and you're planning on getting down on one knee, please don't do it because you're trying to get back at your ex-girlfriend. That is not good. No, <laughs> and you're right because that's essentially what Justin did. Mainly because he knows things, if things with Caleb were to escalate, they could get serious because apparently Selena has been friends with the Stevens family for a long time. So yeah. it would be a very easy step for them to kind of move into that serious territory. So after finding out this info, like kind of what you said, Justin started hanging out with Haley more seriously. Then that brings us to this week when he popped the question. Obviously, we've been talking about it nonstop. Yeah. And therefore, although he may love Haley, I mean, his Instagram post was pretty sweet. <laughs> um, the source maintains that the whole proposal is thanks to Selena. The source said, quote, Selena's friends all know that the only reason he got engaged was to get back at Selena. She thinks it's hilarious that everyone assumes she's dating Caleb to get back at Justin when it's the other way around. Oh, my gosh. So messed up. I, you know I don't curse because you don't really either. Yeah. Um, and like I had to drop the F-bomb this morning because I was just like, what is happening? I know. It's really shocking and it's really sad for Haley if this is true. Yeah. Haley's going to get her heart broken, which honestly I see happening no matter what, just because I don't see how dating after a month and then getting engaged could be like, right. a, like a healthy relationship. Yeah. I'm hoping term. it's not. I'm hoping that this isn't true because I've actually started to jump on the the Jaylee train, but I don't know. I, I think know. Uh, something's just not right here. But at least I guess she has a half million dollar ring to you know grab her tears. <laughs> um, all right, you guys, let's talk about Travis and Kylie. So Travis Scott, he realizes that he's got a good thing and he doesn't want to let it go. You know, we're talking about Kylie, and he doesn't want to let her go because of that Forbes cover that we literally can't stop talking about. Crazy. Um, <laughs> as we're told Hollywood Life that Travis is, quote, really proud of Kylie and can't believe how she made so much money in such a short amount of time. He finds her success sexy, a real turn on, <laughs> and he is now thinking of popping the question to his baby mama ASAP. I mean, if I was, you know, dating a billionaire, soon to be billionaire, I would also want to make sure that I locked that down. Yeah, I mean, it makes sense, but Travis is making his own money. I don't think he really needs Kylie's billions. Well, but his net worth is around $8 million. Actually, by the end of this year, he's expected to have a net worth of $8 million, so he's not quite there yet. I mean, but compared to, like, a billion-dollar net worth, that's really, like, not that much. 
I mean, like, once you reach that, like, multi-million dollar area, I feel like you're going to be set no matter what. <laughs> Devin's and like, stop being ridiculous. It's fine. <laughs> yeah, that's really how I'm feeling. I think you need to propose to Kylie because she's the mother of your child and you love her, not because she's a billionaire. I completely agree. And that's what I said. If I were Kylie, I'd be slightly concerned in this situation yeah. because it's like, Travis didn't feel any urgency to propose before, and now all of a sudden he's like, okay, I'm ready, let's go. Yeah. Um, but the source did add that Travis is still in this for love and that her almost billionaire status is just a bonus. The source said, quote, he loves Kylie, and now that she's practically a billionaire, he would love to lock her down for good. However, we know Kylie's not a billionaire just yet. She's $100 million off. And Forbes, you know, they, they estimate that she'll hit this status by her 21st birthday. Yeah. So Travis... So you better start looking for a ring because it's yeah. going to happen here real soon because there's also a hilarious GoFundMe page going on right now. Have uh -huh. you seen this? I have seen it. So this comedian <laughs> that goes by the name of the Fat Jewish set up this GoFundMe page and the description says, I don't want to live in a world where Kylie Jenner doesn't have a billion dollars. Then in all caps, so you know he's serious, <laughs> he wrote, we must raise a hundred million dollars to help her get a billion. Please spread the word. This is extremely important. It is extremely important. You guys, <laughs> as ridiculous as this is, people have actually been donating. Oh like five dollars here, ten dollars here, and it's earned almost three hundred dollars. So nowhere near a hundred million, but people are still donating. I mean, I feel like people are like, I'm gonna give five dollars as a joke. Kylie does not need your GoFundMe page, people. <laughs> well, five dollars starts as a joke and it adds up real quick. Yeah, I know. So I don't know. If that GoFundMe page takes off, Travis, you better have a ring ready. And maybe you could talk to Justin Bieber, because clearly uh he knows how to pick one out. He does know how to pick one out. Also, Travis, get a bottle of vodka, 21st birthday. She's going to All right, drink. I like, I like. Celebrate. I like. Billionaire, <laughs> engagement, 21st birthday. Woo, what woo. a celebration. <laughs> All right, something that's not quite a celebration is what happened with Danielle Bergoli last night. She narrowly escaped being attacked on stage um, at her show in Amsterdam. TMZ reported this entire thing. So as you guys all know, Danielle Bergoli, AKA Bad Baby, she's on an international tour called the Band in the USA Tour. Hmm. Oh, yeah, Great yeah. name. Yeah, <laughs> I'm just like, every time I hear that she's on tour, I'm just like, you started out as a teen on Dr. Phil, and now she's like a millionaire. I know, Ugh. it's wild. It's ridiculous to me. But anyway, TMZ reports that while she was in the middle of her XXX Tentacion tribute, one fan decided that he would ruin the moment and totally overstep his boundaries. Um, concert goers filmed the entire thing. You can see Danielle up there rapping away. And then this guy comes out of nowhere, rushes the stage towards Danielle. And in literally two seconds, her bodyguard literally pulled a spider monkey and like slightly cannonballed into the audience and just like straight up tackles the guy. Oh my gosh. It was crazy. Um, the bodyguard's name is Frank and he like totally saved the day. Yeah. Um, but I don't doubt that Danielle, if the bodyguard wasn't there, that she could have taken care of herself. I feel like that girl <laughs> can totally throw a couple punches. <laughs> for sure. So it, I think, you know, it's nice to see that her bodyguards are always there for her. She's very thankful for them. She hasn't really commented on the whole incident on social media. So that tells me that she's really not that concerned about it. So I think yeah. she's just going to keep going on that tour and not sweat it. Yeah, that would be a really scary incident, though, to be somebody yeah. like her on stage. That always freaks me out thinking about that. So Completely agree. Good job to Frank for saving the day. <laughs> Frank, you're, you're, you're the main man. You're doing your job real well. <laughs> the real MVP. <laughs> yeah. All right, you guys, we want to hear your thoughts on all of these stories. What do you think about the real reason behind Justin Bieber and Haley Baldwin's engagement, a.k.a. Selena Gomez? What do you think about Travis Scott wanting to put a ring on Kylie Jenner now that she's almost a billionaire? And last but not least, what do you think about that scary moment that went down with Danielle Bergoli on stage last night? Talk it all out down there in the comments. Don't forget to subscribe, and we'll see you guys here next time on Holly Scoops Daily Rewind.